Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's Jarelli and today I wanted to show you guys everything I got for my birthday. My birthday was November 25th, which was Thanksgiving. And um, yeah, I just got a few things. Um, I don't really ask for anything on my birthday um, for years now, but I got a lot of things. And I'm just gonna show you guys everything I got. Um, I appreciate everything that I got. And I use everything that I got. Um, so yeah, there's not any kind of waste in any of these things that I got. So before we get into the video, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel, give this video a thumbs up, and follow me on Instagram and TikTok because I post a lot of other kinds of content. So yeah, let's get into the video. Also, we have here Champion, and we're just getting ready to go to bed. And yeah, my little cheap is here. He's my little old man, and he's just ignoring me, so... Um, he just wants this toy. But I got this Morphe by um, Morphe X Ariel. You can barely see the packaging because it's so like beige. But um, if you didn't know, this is Ariel Tejada. Tejada, Tejada, I don't know, whatever you guys want to call it. But um, he's Kylie Jenner's makeup artist and like other people's makeup artist, which I, I mainly know him by as Kylie Jenner's makeup artist. So I got the brush set, um, which is this one. And I've already been using them. I actually got two of these. My sister gave me uh, one of them, and then my brother's girlfriend and my brother gave me this one. Um, so yeah, now I have two sets of these, which I'm super grateful because I really thought about getting another um, set of the brushes after my sister gave me the one. Um, and yeah, I just really like these brushes. They're neutral and they're very fluffy. I really love the quality of them. They're so cute. They're so aesthetic. And um, I feel like they're gonna last a really long time. So I'm really grateful for getting these brushes. Um, I love them and I've been wanting them for a while now too. Okay, I'm just gonna go into it in like any kind of order right now because I'm a mess and I got a few things. So um, yeah, if we jump from makeup to like clothes and then back to like other things, I'm sorry, I'm just not doing this in like any kind of order. I've been wanting for a while. Um, it was this Jacquemus earmuffs. Um, so my grandma gave me money for my birthday, which she really didn't have to do. Every time my grandma gives me money, I usually buy something that I will use and I will just keep it as a memory. Sorry if it's super bright in the background. I just have white lights on right now. Just because I don't want to bring my studio, studio uh, I don't want to bring my studio light in. But yeah. Um, so here are the earmuffs. They're so cute. Um, I'll put a photo of like the model on here. Um, but yeah, they're Jacquemus. It has a little signature, um, like Simon's signature on here and yeah there were $70 I mean they're super cheap for like designer earmuff earmuffs because I think the Chanel ones are like $700 or $1200 I'm not really sure they're only one size and my big head surprisingly fits in here but yeah I've been using them quite a while but like quite a bit and I definitely think that they keep my ears warm because I'm always cold and I hate being cold um, I also came with like this super cute postcard is like a little sneaker um i always keep postcards i never use them it just comes with like the envelope it says jacquemus as well it just says thank you on the inside and yeah i really love these jacquemus earmuffs uh jacquemus is one of my favorite designers so um i'm so excited that i finally have something from him and i really love this dust bag it's so cute i keep it as decoration on top of my suitcases that i have in front of my bed um, and yeah, it's just so cute. It looks like you can use it as a little clutch or something. So another thing I got for my grandma, which I don't even think she gave them to me on my birthday, but are these super cute earrings. I used them like four days ago, I think, or five days ago. They're like, um, they're 10 carat earrings, gold. Um, they're like a light blue, like a baby blue diamond on the bottom. Like crystals, I don't think they're diamonds, but they're crystals, and then it has like a white crystal on top. I like studded earrings, like stud earrings, because they're just so much easier. Like I hate wearing hoops or like other kinds of earrings. Um, I usually tend to go um, and wear these more, so yeah. Now, if you guys don't know, I am a vinyl addict. I love buying vinyls. I literally have like so many that I, I can't even keep track of anymore. So I got this Sade um, vinyl. Um, I got it a few days ago. 
it's the um, Diamond La Diamond Life vinyl. So it's from 1985. Um, and yeah, it has a lot of my favorite songs on here. I love her voice. I love everything about her. Um, and yeah, the vinyl is super cute. I love the photo. It's one of my favorite singers, or at least one of my favorite bands. Um, and yeah, my first uh, Sade vinyl. And then I just got this uh, Beatles, Beatles rubber sole vinyl a few days ago. It's not a vintage. Um, this is a replica, which I'm planning on getting the vintage one as soon as I find a cheap one because everyone sells them for like so much money. So um, yeah, I got this one. This is also another one of my favorite um, albums from the Beatles. I, to be honest, I never got into the Beatles, but now I'm like a fan of them. So yeah, I like this album and maybe just because they worked together on it for like the first time like actually appreciating each other because i know they hated each other but um yeah um, i'm excited this is like maybe my fourth beatles album that i have i don't have many of them i mostly collect like duran duran or Blondie or um like alton john and i prefer listening to vinyl instead of going on my spotify or youtube because i hate ads and also I hate being on my phone when I'm listening to music so yeah I really like listening to my films. next thing I got from my brother and his girlfriend is this Morphe 35X big primpin palette which if you guys didn't see my last video already um, I use this palette in that video it's just like the new Morphe palette with like the nude colors like the everyday cute nude colors and i've been using a lot of these um, shades i really like the colors like they're my favorite like when i saw this when it released i was like i need that so uh, like i was so surprised that they actually got me that palette but um yeah i'm also thankful for this um i love the packaging it's so cute it's like pink and i just feel like it matches my style so much my aesthetic um and yeah, I can't wait to continue using this. If you guys want more looks with this palette, please comment down below. So the next thing I got um, were a new pair of sneakers. First of all, they're affordable, okay? Like if you guys are looking for like new cute sneakers, you need these. So these are from Nike. Um, these are like 80s style sneakers. Um, why isn't this focusing? Okay, so sorry if they got dark, but these are um, the new Nike shoes that I got. I've been wearing them. It has like a super good grip on the bottom. I know that these used to be used to like play tennis um, and they are true to size. Um, uh, I'm a size six. I have very small feet, but they fit exactly and they're super comfortable. They do not hurt my knees. I have really bad knee problems when I wear like um, like snum, snum, like some sneakers. So I'm really surprised that these actually perform well. I really wanted the Reebok um, C85, I think that's what they're called. They have like the terry cloth on the inside and they're like green and beige on the outside. Really wanted those and I'm definitely still gonna get them once they restock. Um, and yeah, they're also affordable, they're like $80. And I think that Reebok like raised $5 on those shoes, but I'm definitely still gonna get them because they look super comfortable and Reebok is like, they make really good shoes, so yeah, I'm, I'm out shopping for clothes. Um, I want thrifting as well. So like one of, I think I showed, yeah, I showed it on TikTok. So I made a TikTok a few days ago. Um, I thrifted this beautiful like feminine ballerina kind of play suit. So it's old because the tag is faded already. Um, but yeah, it's a little play suit, which I would definitely wear with like pants or something. Yeah, I really love the detail, it's lace. And I love pink. I really like the pink color. Um, David Paul New York um, kind of like brown blazer, like the pinstripes. And I think it's so cute. I already used it the day I went shopping at the Woodbury Commons in New York, um, which is my first time going there because I never really go to like upstate New York. But um, yeah, I think I really like that um, shopping place. And I went to Ralph's Coffee, even though employees were terrible there, but. I really liked it. Um, the croissant was actually not that bad, even though it was cold, but yeah. Speaking of Ralph Lauren, I got a Ralph Lauren um, vest, a sweater vest. I think this is like a boy's vest. I don't even know. It was a size large and it looks like a size small to me. 
I got it for like seven dollars and the original tag sent like three hundred dollars which I'm surprised that they didn't list it as like the original price at the thrift store I can't wait to wear this I go to Cupline at the outlets just because like Cupline regular doesn't really like make such a difference with like the outlet um so I found some things that look like literally skims um by Kim Kardashian so I got this like fuzzy tank top and it once I saw it it literally reminded me of skims like skims they're so overpriced um I don't know why but skims if you're watching this please send some things over because I really want um loungewear but I got this Calvin Klein. It's also like a baby pink color. I think this is part of like the vintage collection of Calvin Klein, like in 90s. And then I found this baby pink bodysuit. Um, it's like a low back bodysuit. But yeah, it's open back. I was looking for like boxers or like boy shorts, but they only had beige ones and they were not on sale. So I like, I really like the pink ones as well because I really wasn't liking the beige. Got some underwear, like the high-waisted, um, just like the gray band. And then I got this one, which I really thought it was cute. It's like the all pink and it has the CK in the middle on the front. So I really love that. And they're so soft and so comfortable. To be honest, this, this is not like part of my birthday gift, but I'm just gonna include it just cause why not? Oh, forgot one thing. This is the Come Klein tank top that I also got. Um, this one, I didn't really plan on buying at first. But again, it reminds me so much of Skims and it's so soft and I the only reason that I wasn't going to buy it is because it's cropped but once I tried it on here at home, it was not that cropped. Then I have these Old Navy um, turtlenecks I got at um, Old Navy, if you didn't know, why did I just say that? Um, but yeah, I got the brown and then I got this like taupey beige and then I also got like um a mauve beige kind of color which i really love turtlenecks if you didn't know that if you don't see me like posting regularly with a turtleneck on um i just really like turtlenecks it makes me look like elegant and all that like a rich lady already so yeah this thermal thermo thermal uh shirt which i think it's like pajama top actually but it's so soft and also like i don't really like spend time digging through these stores I barely go into Old Navy and all that, but yeah, um, I found that stuff and it was not that expensive. I went to Walmart a few days ago and I literally found the best sweaters ever. Like I've been looking for crewnecks for a long time already, like cute plain crewnecks. Um, cause I'm always wearing like the same sweaters every single day. But you know, like whenever I want to wear like a cute jacket and I want like a sweater to overpower it or something, I always look for a cute plain crewneck and I found these at Walmart. Um, I think it was like $8 each, like, it's so soft, and it's so, like, plain and, like, amazing, because I really like plain clothes. I used to be, like, that one person who would buy graphic t-shirts when I was younger, and now I regret that, because I really hate graphic t-shirts now. Lastly, I got this loungewear, um, it's gray velvet from Old Navy as well. It's so soft, but yeah, if you guys can't tell, it is super soft. It's a whole um, lounge outfit. It's cropped. The sweater's cropped a little bit, but the pants are pretty high waisted, and they have like the elastic um, at the bottom and at the top, and on the sleeves as well. So I really like that. Um, and yeah, I don't ask for anything on my birthday to be honest. I just, I just don't care about birthdays anymore. Like I'm, I'm over it. Ever since I turned like 13 or 14, I was over it already. I was tired of birthdays. And I just didn't really care anymore, but um, yeah, I kept forgetting that it was my birthday this year. I'm really grateful for everything that I got. Um, if I didn't say it in the last video, I hope you guys had a great Thanksgiving. I hope you guys are thankful for the lives that you were living, for having another day to wake up and all that. Um, yeah, don't take anything for granted. Although we may take things for granted sometimes, but at the end of the day, be thankful that you're still alive on this planet. Um, yeah, I'm grateful that I turned 18, even though I feel 12. Um, but yeah, I don't really ever get to talk like this on my channel for some reason. I always feel like everything has to be like written down or something. Um, but yeah, I'm really grateful for everything. Um, 
Can't wait to see 19 years next year. If you guys want to see me wear this stuff, uh, follow me on TikTok and Instagram. And yeah, that's pretty much it for you guys um, today in this video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, give this video a thumbs up, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!